Hi guys, I'm Tom Holland. And I'm Neil Druckmann. And we're here today to talk about our new movie, Uncharted. Yeah, it's been a long, long time in the making. How I, long have you been working on the idea of a film of Uncharted? Uh, I came on Uncharted in 2006, and we're just like trying to conceive of like, how do we capture the feel of a cinematic summer blockbuster on the control? Rise up! It's interesting what you say about like making a summer blockbuster because when we were making it into a film, the game is already so cinematic. We had a kind of base layer to how we wanted the film to look. The hardest thing to try and recreate was the heart of the games. But my favorite thing uh, that is paying respect to the games is the little puzzles along the way. Whether it's pushing the tile in the crypt or the, the door, putting the two crosses together, that kind of stuff for me was my my favorite aspect. That's supposed to happen? I don't know. Well, elements of the game were, were really important to you to maintain in the film. Making Nate relatable, making him human. Well, I'm pretty sure he's just threatening to kill me. Don't touch your ear like that. You look like an idiot. I love that it's an origin story and we see how he comes up and we see him as a bartender and we just see him like it's just a regular kid trying to get by, but there's this this itch that's yeah. like like he's, he's he's not sure how to satisfy it like the origin of that itch this idea that young nate loves his history he loves his ancestry he loves the idea of going out there and finding this treasure so later in the film when we meet him and sully and sully presents him with this opportunity you understand why he leaves his life yeah, behind he can't he can't say he no can't say no we were meant for this nathan were you nervous meeting the original nathan drake i actually was you know <laughs> I mean, I was such a big fan of the games, um, and he has such a distinct voice. Mm. Oh, crap! And the nicest thing for me is that he's been so supportive of me kind of inheriting this character and bringing in my new ideas and this new flavor to, to Nathan Drake. Could you move any slower? So what was it like, you know, being against Chloe, who's a character from the game? And Sophia did such a wonderful job of building this character that is very intriguing to Nate. You have no idea who you partnered with. What I find interesting is taking this material, being inspired by it, and making it your own, and yeah. re reinterpreting it, and that's the exciting part for us. I think what you said there is, is key, is that this is our own version of it. I think the fan base of the games are going to be really impressed with this kind of unique version of their, you know, beloved games. You know, movies aren't made like this anymore. Yeah, and I'm glad movies. that we were able to pull this off. I actually saw this on my PlayStation the other day, and it also plays at the end of our trailer that you guys are remastering. Yes, we're remastering Uncharted 4 and Lost Legacy. We're really excited that um, this remastered version is coming out on the PlayStation 5. Well, I am as well. Oh, crap! Oh!